day four and problem four a word search we need to find the word xmas horizontal vertical diagonal written backwards or even overlapping other words we need to find all instances of xmas diagonally here all right That sounds easy, just few iterations, few for loops. All right. Uh, so how do we do it? We read into an array of strings. There is uh, S of H. Let's call that greater A. For every row, for every row in the grid, read the row. Now that it's here, from every cell I want to start and go in each of the eight directions. And I'm going to create, and basically you can go right, down, up, left, and diagonally for directions. So what I'm going to do is iterate the starting cell h row plus plus the width is the length of the first string for every column uh, if i can do here and if if this is if this is an x no it doesn't affect time complexity no iterate directions and when you have four neighbors the best way to do it is to create a list of four pairs if you have all the eight neighbors so you consider eight directions then the way i usually do it is i make a for loop from row minus one to row plus one you here iterate your neighbor but you don't want to go below zero though we will anyway have the function inside because we will continue doing other things, uh, right? Or, mm, yeah, let, let's make a function inside. Given row and column, return that it's in range, row smaller than height of the grid. Right, now, because I'm going to follow this direction, I don't want just my one neighbor, I want the direction. So I will iterate delta row from negative one to one. I iterate delta column from delta, uh, negative one to one. And if both are zero, then this is not good direction, though I don't need to skip it because nothing will happen here. No, let's skip it. D row is zero and D call is zero, then continue. Now, I have a direction that I should follow to look for the following characters, M, A, and S. Uh, so now let's try four times. If, uh, let's make it f nice and flexible. We are looking for the string, the template, Xmas. For every character, we have the row, which is equal to delta row times I and column equal to this if this is inside and a of r2c2 is equal to whatever i need in the template then this is okay and uh, else break i don't know we can do good count good values or maybe all okay is true here all OK is false and if all OK then I increase the answer by one which is you can add boolean to integer it will possibly add one at the end print the answer the answer of course we need to create starts as zero do we have something ignore that 2400 something 
correct answer continue to part two did you misunderstand the assignment you need to find two mass in the shape of an x but do they need to follow exactly this shape no it can go from down but can it be okay it needs to be x shape so only diagonally okay so that the solution will be completely different right we're looking for something that has an a and the diagonals <coughs> uh, the diagonals need to be mm next to each other and ss next to each other a m m s s m's can be on the left right yeah okay let's make a copy and how do we do that i think we will look at the middle character which is a then we try the four neighbors also i cannot consider something in the first row or in the last row first row or in the last row because then you don't have any neighbors uh, in at least one direction this function i don't need anymore this thing also i do not need if something is an a then i need to consider the four diagonals and this time i will iterate pairs so uh, we can create it earlier whatever uh, directions is negative one negative one negative one positive one 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 negative one and the order here is important i will explain later why but i want it to follow count clockwise or counterclockwise the order is important because we don't want to count something like this i believe that this we should not count if m is opposite of each other so it's important that here i follow the order uh, that let's say negative negative one means the smaller row and column the negative one positive one that means that column increases so it's one two three four and in this order two m's need to be next to each other and two s's next to each other not the opposite uh, all right so the let's collect the characters for every direction in the directions s plus equal a of rho plus dear first plus dear second that's my neighbor and now i want s to contain ms where two m's are next to each other should i just list down all the possibilities like this i think it's so small this number of possibilities that this is safer than doing it with for loops but i could iterate the four positions check if this is m and the next position is m though possibly it can wrap around uh, you know and i did miss something <laughs> there should be four possibilities obviously because the string length is four so if this then answer plus plus part two in we got something and that's the right answer all right sorry for doing this one day late but i didn't have time yesterday and in a moment i will record and upload as well day five thank you for watching bye